the 2022 Hot Wheels A case. I get all of my Hot Wheels cases from GranitToys.com. If you want to get your own Hot Wheels case sent to you every time a new one comes out, then go check out GranitToys.com. I will link it in the description box below. The treasure hunt for this case is the Dark Knight Batmobile, and the super treasure hunt for this case is the 55 Chevy. Hopefully we find one of those in this case. All right, let's go ahead and unbox it. And we'll start it up right at the top right here. We'll grab our first cars out. Our first one is Roadster Bite. Then we've got the GTR Liberty Walk Edition, the long name on there. I'm not gonna read the whole name out, but a very cool looking car. And then we have the Skull Crusher. We'll go on to our next three up top right here. And we've got the Mighty K, which is a new casting for 2022. We have the custom small block and Moto Wing in the Hot Wheels Racing Team colors. Very nice. And next up we do have the Nissan Skyline 2000 GTR in a new gray color. We've got the Bad Bagger and the 2020 Ram 1500 Rebel. Next, we do have the Mazda REPU, the pickup truck. We've got a new color of the 2019 Mercedes-Benz A-Class and we have the Fire Eater fire truck. Very cool, I like those ones. Next, we do have the Geo Terra, then we have the Batmobile and Water Bomber. We've got the 85 Chevrolet Camaro IROC Z, the 67 Ford Mustang Coupe, and the Minecart, a new color variation of that one. We've got Hot Bird, which is a Firebird. We've got the Baja Bone Shaker and the Dodge Challenger Drift Car in that nice Hot Wheels Racing Team livery. Coming up, we've got the Toyota A86 Sprinter Truno, the 85 Chevrolet Camaro IROC Z, and a Mercedes Benz Unimog 1300. 76 Greenwood Corvette, I really like that one. We've got the tuned Volkswagen Golf MK1, that's a new casting for 2022. And we've got the 67 Chevelle SS 396. We've got the 67 Ford Mustang Coupe, and we've got the Dark Knight Batmobile, and uh, that one is the treasure hunt of the case. You can see the little treasure hunt logo just in the back right there, but there is our Dark Knight Batmobile treasure hunt. Very cool that we got that one in this case. After that, we do have the Bogzilla right there. Very, very cool. We'll put him aside. And we've got the Mod Rod, a new color of that. We've got the Aston Martin V12 Speedster. I really like that car. And the Nash. And for our last cars of the bottom of our first case right here for the first half, we've got the Chevy Silverado Off-Road, 2017 Ford GT, and the custom Honda N600. All right, those are our first cars. Let's see what we have on our second half of the case. We'll pull out that paperwork and we've got a bunch of really cool cars in this one as well. We'll grab from the top right here. We've got the Shelby Cobra 427 SC. We've got the Range Rover Classic and the Nissan 2000 GTR. Check that one out, the Skyline GTR. Very cool, I like the color on that. And we'll grab some more from the top up here. We've got the Roadster Bite, Pagani Waira, love that gold, and the 2020 Toyota GR Supra in a new yellow colorway. And we've got another one of those Liberty Walk Nissan GTRs, the Standard Cart, and another Batmobile. And we'll grab our cars right up here. We've got the Water Bomber, and we've got the Let's Go, looks like a nice new color of that one. The Tuned Volkswagen Golf MK1, another one of those. 
And we do have, ooh, I really like this, the Porsche 935. Such a cool looking casting. Really like the look of that one. We've got another one of the Mercedes-Benz Unimog 1300s and another Chevy Silverado off-road. What else do we have up top right here? We've got the Indy 500 Oval. We've got the Muscle and Blowin' and the 67 Chevelle SS 396. All right, some good cars in this case. There's another GR Supra right there in that yellow. We've got another Batmobile and we've got the Fast Gassin. And what else do we have? There's another cool looking Range Rover. We'll start at the bottom right there. That Range Rover Classic. We've got the Twinning and Winning. And we have the Bubble Matic. Check that one out. You can actually blow real bubbles in that one. Very cool looking car. And going down here, we've got another Pagani Waira, another Porsche 935. And we have, this one is the mainline variation, but this would be the super treasure hunt of the case if there was a super treasure hunt. Still possible we might have one in there, but that's your mainline variation, which looks very, very good. I really do like that car. Very cool to have that one. Put that one aside. We'll grab the Muscle and Blown, another one of those. We've got the Mighty K again, and another Geoterra. And we'll go on down to our last row right here. We've got the Car de Asada, very, very interesting casting. It's uh, basically, it's a taco. Very, very cool, I like it. Uh, Dodge Challenger drift car and the 85 Honda Civic Turbo 2 in a new colorway. Very, very nice to have that. And our last three cars of the case are the custom 70 Honda N600, the Shelby Cobra 427SC, and the fire eater in the comment section down below let me know which was your favorite car of this case and today we're unboxing the 2022 hot wheels b case i get all of my cases from granitetoys.com if you want to get your own hot wheels cases sent to you go check out granitetoys.com links in the description box below the treasure hunt of this case is the quick bite and the super treasure hunt of this case is the 1973 BMW 3.0 CSL race car. Hopefully we find one of these in this case. All right, let's go ahead and unbox it. And we'll start it up at the top right here. And our first car that we have is the Skull Crusher. And our second car is one that I'm very excited about because you guys know the McLaren F1 is my favorite car. We have the new recolor of the McLaren F1 GTR and it looks fantastic in this teal color with the colored wheels on there. Next, we have the Roadster Bite. And we'll move those on to the side. And up top, we've got our treasure hunt of the case. We found the quick buy. Check it out. It's got hot dogs written on the side of it with a big hot dog just down there. Very, very cool. And if you actually kind of look behind it, you can't really see. If we kind of look through the car, you can see there is a treasure hunt logo within there. We also do have the treasure hunt logo just on the back right here of the quick bite. So very cool, we found the treasure hunts of the case right away as well. We found the mine cart as well, and we got twinning and winning in the Hot Wheels Racing Team livery. We'll put those aside. Next up, we've got the Tooligan and the 2020 Ram 1500 Rebel. We saw that one in our previous case. And we have Street Cleaver. Street Cleaver, Street Clever. I'm not too sure the exact pronunciation. That's a new casting, very, very cool. Part of like a construction series. We have the HW Metro series now, but that is very, very nice to have a new casting like that. Next up on the top right here, we've got the 2019 Mercedes-Benz A-Class. We saw that one in the previous case as well. Mazda REPU. And we've got a new recolor of the Loco Motorin. That is cool with the chrome on the top and then the darker color on the base. We actually saw previously a fully chrome one of these. So that's an interesting touch to that new casting as well. 
I'll put that aside and then up top right here, we've got the Volkswagen Beetle. Very, very nice to see a new kind of like a woody addition to that. And we've got the Tesla Cybertruck from the HW Hot Trucks. And this one will just have, I think it's slightly different wheels compared to the other castings. I'm really not sure why that we just keep getting the same colorway of the, uh, of the Tesla Cybertruck. Hopefully we'll get maybe a black one or a white one or some sort of green one or something like that. That'd be cool to get a different color besides just kind of that uh, raw finish to it, which is just what it is in real life. But in the future, we'll possibly get some more. Then we've got the Nash as well. That's a nice one. We saw that one in our previous case though. Up top right here, we've got the Fast Fish right there. Very, very cool. And we've got Brickin tra Bricking Trails. That is a new casting as well. And that's part of that Mega Block series so we can fit Mega Block and Lego kind of the go hand in hand, but they can fit right on this car as well. That's really, really cool. We also got another nice one here. We got the 87 Ford Sierra Cosworth. Check that out. That is really cool. Look at the spoiler on the back of that one. Hot Wheels written on the side of it. Very, very cool to see that one. That's a new one for 2022. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, we've got the uh, Volkswagen Golf MK1, the tuned out variation. We've got a new colorway of the Ford Focus RS in that nice light blue color. And we've got the Skull Shaker. Looks like a new color of that one as well. Very nice. We'll put those aside. And then we'll pull out the 76 Corvette Greenwood. We've got the Track Manga, brand new color of that one. And La Fasta, very cool. All right, we'll put those aside. What else do we have? We have another Mazda RAPU pickup. We've got Big Rig, and we've got the Toyota AE86 Sprinter Truno. We did see that one in the previous case as well. And we've got the Disney Steamboat, is that a new color of that one? That is a new color of the Disney Steamboat. We've got Track Manga again, and the Baja Bone Shaker. And we have Flyby, very cool, I like that. We've got the Batman Akram Aslam Batmobile in there as well, and a new color of the 2016 Cadillac ATS VR. Wow, that is a really cool new color for that Cadillac. Can't wait to open that one up in a future video. And we've got, for the last uh, cars of our first half of the case here, we've got the Tooligan, we've got the 55 Chevy Bel Air Gasser, and that is an interesting color for that Gasser. We also have another Tesla Cybertruck as well. Very cool that we got two of those in this case so far. And let's go down to the second half or the bottom half of the case right here. Pull that packaging aside. We'll start off at the top right here. Oh, we've got a new color of the 2020 Jeep Gladiator with the Borla written on the side of it. We've got the Toyota AE86 Sprinter Truno and the Velosa Racer. Look at that one in that nice red color. And we'll put those aside. We'll grab the other cars at the top right here. We've got an, a 57 Chevy. Look at the color of that one. That is crazy. It's like, it looks like a matte red with the matte white finish on there. Very, very cool. I can't wait to open that one up. 2019 Mercedes Benz A Class and the 85 Honda City Turbo 2. Those ones we both saw in the previous case. And we'll go ahead, grab the top right here. We've got the standard carts, fast fish, and fast gassing. All right. And what else do we have? We've got a Let's Go, another tuned Volkswagen Golf MK1, and we've got the 55 Chevy Bel Air Gasser. Again, another one of those ones in that interesting new color. And what else do we have? We've got the La Fasta, the 2020 Jeep Gladiator Borla Edition again, and a Porsche 935. I absolutely love that casting. Can't wait to see more recolors of that one. And we'll go up top right here. We've got the 1970 Pontiac Firebird, and this one 
is your Hot Wheels Legends Tour winning car right there. So Hot Wheels, uh, here, so we'll look at the top right there. There we go, Legends Tour winner. So every year we have the Hot Wheels Legends Tour and that is your winning car. I really like that. Very, very cool customization on there. Looks absolutely fantastic. So it's really cool that that was made into a Hot Wheels casting. We also did get the 70s Chevelle right there and a Bogzilla. And going down to the next cars here, we've got the Bubble Manic, the another one of the Batmobiles right there. That's the Akram Aslam Batmobile and another Volkswagen Beetle, that Woody on the side of it. We saw at the start of this case as well. I'll put those aside. We'll go down right here. We've got the Car de Asada, the Fast Gassin, and Twinning and Winning. All right, some great cars in this case so far. Uh, there's another one of the 1970 Pontiac Firebirds, the Legends Tour winner. Uh, we've got another Brickin Trails right there. And we have our 55 Chevy. This one is a Super Treasure Hunt in the 2022 A case but we've just got the mainline variation of it. So very nice to have a mainline variation of that car right there. We've got some more cars here. We've got another Porsche 935, another Ford Focus RS, and we've got the Mighty K, a new casting for 2022. We'll put those ones aside. Getting down to the bottom row right here, we've got the Car de Asada, the 85 Honda City Turbo 2, and another 87 Ford Sierra Cosworth. Another one of those really cool castings. And our last three cars of the case, we have the 2016 Cadillac ATS VR again. We've got a nice new recolor of the 1973 BMW 3.0 CSL race car. This one is not the Super Treasure Hunt. This would be the Super Treasure Hunt of the case if it was, but that is your mainline variation of it. And our last car is the Humvee. Guys, let me know in the comment section down below which is your favorite car in this case today. We're gonna to unbox the 2022 Hot Wheels D case. I get all of my Hot Wheels cases from GranitToys.com. So if you wanna get your own Hot Wheels case, check out GranitToys.com. I'll link it in the description box below. The treasure hunt for this case is the tuned twin mill. And the super treasure hunt for this case is the 1963 Studebaker Champ. Hopefully we find one of these in this case. All right, let's go ahead and unbox it. And we'll start it off right at the top right here. We'll pull out our first ones and wow, check out our first one. I've been waiting for this car, the Coupe Clip. And I'm pretty sure this is just like a full metal slab of a car. I honestly don't know the full story on this car. We're gonna have to look this up before we open this car up, but that is just very, very interesting of a new Hot Wheels casting. I almost thought this was a joke when Hot Wheels first posted this, but it, it actually exists and there you go. So we'll open that one up in a future video and see what it's all about. Next, we've got the classic TV series Batmobile. Then we've got the Count Muscula right there as our next car. And we'll go up to our top and see what else we have. We've got the Barbie Dream Camper, the Ragin' Express, and Vencinator, a new color of that one as well. Very nice. Good start to the case. We'll go up to our top again. We've got Mad Manga. We've got the Ford GT40 Mark IV and a brand new casting. I've been looking forward to getting this one. This is the 2020 Toyota Tacoma pickup truck. I love the blue color on this one. Great details on this one. This is gonna be a super fun one to open up in our next video. And we'll go back up to the top. 68 Dodge Dart with the big Dodge on the side from our HW Art Car Series. We've got that Ford Mustang Mach-E 1400. So that's another brand new casting. Check that one out. Big spoiler on the back of that. Very, very cool looking car. We've got the custom Ford Bronco right below that with the nice mudded out tires on there. Very nice looking. And what else do we have right here? We've got another Ford Bronco. Check out the muddy tires on that one as well. Very nice. I'm really liking the, the new Ford Bronco. The new casting of that looks really good. We've got the uh, Fusion Busta in a brand new color. And we've got the Mercedes-Benz 500E in red. I'm a big fan of that casting. Looking great in that red color. 
And what else do we have right here? We do have the Sweet Driver. Check that one out. It is a cupcake. Very interesting new casting. We've got the Rally Baja Crawler and the, uh, the GT Scorcher right there in a brand new color. That one's looking good. I like the color on that one. Looks excellent for that GT Scorcher. And we'll see what we have right here. We've got the 69 Copo Corvette, another one of the Dodge Dart art cars and another coupe clip. Awesome, good to have a couple of those coupe clips. Very, very nice. And we'll go down right here. We've got another 67 Ford GT40 Mark IV in the Golf livery, the classic TV series Batmobile tuned up variation, and the Mazda RX-7. Loving the new recolor of that one, looking excellent. And we'll go right here. We've got the Bully Goat. Bully Goat, okay, that's an interesting new cast. I think that's a new casting, if I'm not mistaken. Almost looks like a, a, a Pontiac Firebird on the front end, so. Interesting new one right there. We've got two Nissan R390 GT1s in white, side by side together right there. Awesome, awesome, liking those cool new recolors. And this looks to be our treasure hunt. It is our treasure hunt. So we got the tuned twin mill treasure hunt in this case. So awesome that we found a treasure hunt. You can see the treasure hunt logo just right on the top of it right there. We'll definitely open this one up in a future video. Awesome, I'm glad to get that one. And we have another one of the GT Scorchers and we've got the X-Jet and it looks to be, I think that's a new color of the X-Jet if I'm not mistaken, but very nice looking stealth like plane casting right there, the X-Jet. And what do we have right here? We've got the wheelie chair. That looks to be a new color of wheelie chair. We've got the Subaru WRX STI, and that one's got like some weird sort of like mountain type siding on it. Very interesting, I like that. Uh, USS Enterprise NCC 1701, but very cool to have that one. And our last three cars of the first half right here before we go on down to our next base right here. We've got the Mazda RX-7, another one of those. We've got the custom 2001 Acura Integra GSR, liking that new color. And another one of the Mustang Mach-E 1400s. Awesome, awesome, got a couple of those ones now as well. We'll go down to our bottom right here. Take that paper cardboard out and we'll go right up to the top again. And we'll pull out our first three cars. We've got the Eruption. Ooh, look at that. New color of Eruption. I like the orange on the top right there. We've got Turtle Shell and the 21 Ford Bronco. Another one of those ones with those mudded out tires. That's that brand new Bronco with the cool front end on it. All right, liking that one. We'll go right up here. And we've got, ooh, there is the 63 Studebaker Champ, but that one looks to be the mainline variation, not the Super Trash Hunt. So we do have the mainline. So, I mean, there's still a chance that the Super could be down in the bottom of our uh, case right here, but we'll have to see. Uh, we've got the 2009 Ford F-150 with a good year on the side of it. We've got the Kick Cart. Looks like a new color of Kick Cart. Awesome, awesome, liking that one. And we'll go up top. We've got the Dodge van right there. I love this casting. I know it's just a Dodge van, but I have said that this one is just so detailed. Very, very nice. It's even got that little go-kart in the back of it. Very cool. We've got the Blade Raider. It looks to be a new color of that one. And we have the 2019 Chevy Silverado Trail Boss LT with the big Borla on the side of it. Look at that, very cool. And we'll put that down. We do have a new recolor, the one that I've been most excited for. It is the, the 94 Bugatti EB110 SS, and the SS stands for Super Sport in yellow now. Check it out, my favorite color. If you guys know me, you know yellow is my favorite color. Absolutely love this casting. Was super excited to see its first release. Now we're getting some recolors of it but looks very, very good. We've got the Bully Goat again, and a Toyota Land Cruiser 80 with, look at the, the side of that one. Look at all the, the nice graphics and stuff. That is interesting. Very, very nice. I do like that one. That one's a mudded out one with the mudded out tires on there as well. And we'll go up right here. We've got another one of the Mercedes-Benz 500E. We've got a Donut Drifter. That looks to be a new color of Donut Drifter. And we've got the Rocket Box. And this one, look at that. It's just like a really tiny car with a little bitty Hot Wheels logo coming out. 
like a kind of a flame job. That's an interesting paint job on there. You can see that little Hot Wheels logo right there. Very, very cool. And what else do we have up here? We've got another one of the Barbie Dream Campers. Uh, another custom 2001 Acura Integra GSR. And it looks to be a new recolor of the Nissan Leaf Nismo RC02. So we got that electric race car. Very nice, I like that red, the red looks good. I'm, li I'm liking all the red cars right now for some reason, lots of good red castings coming out. Another Copo uh, Corvette right there, 69 Copo Corvette. We've got the custom Ford Bronco, another one of those, and another Bugatti EB110 SS in the yellow color. Loving it. All right, let's see, what do we have right here? Classic TV series Batman Bill. I think that's our third one of the case. So that's interesting. Three of them. We've got Ain't Fair, one of the coolest named castings for a Hot Wheels bus. And that one's a new, looks like a new livery on there. The bike on the front of it. Very nice. And we've got the Count Muscula again. Another one of those ones. And we go right here, Donut Drifter, another one of those. We've got the Hyperfin. That looks to be a brand new color of Hyperfin. And that one is from the uh, Fast and Furious Spy Racers Netflix series. And that's that brand new recolor. I like the, the kind of different wheels in the front and back. That looks good. And we do have the HW450F. That is a Hot Wheels dirt bike right there with some cool flames on the side of it. Very nice. And we've got a couple more cars down here. We've got the Simi Rollin. And that one looks to be like some sort of taxi. Livery, yeah it is, it does say taxi on the top of it right there. Very nice, I like that, okay. Uh, Nissan Leaf Nismo, another one of those ones, and another one of the 2020 Toyota Tacomas in blue. I love this casting, I cannot wait to see more recolors of it, but this blue, I mean, how can you top that? That looks excellent, very nice, super happy with that one. And our last row right here, another one of the Rocket Box. Uh, the 56 Ford F100, and that looks to be like a matte red finish. And a 59 Chevy Impala, check that one out. Low riding, look at that, all the graphics on there, the nice gold wheels on there, the gold front grille, chrome gold. That looks really nice. I'm super excited to have that one. Can't wait to open that one up. And our last three cars right here on the bottom, we've got Perfect speed, perfect speed fantasy casting. We've got the uh, Mock It Go. I think that's a brand new casting as well. HW Speed Team, I don't think I've seen that one before. Mock It Go, kind of like Make It Go, but Mock It Go, and it's got the X-Ray type of body on there. And we do have another Subaru WRX STI. Comment down below which car you like the most from this case. Let's go ahead and unbox the 2022 Hot Wheels G case. If you wanna get your own Hot Wheels case, check out granitetoys.com. This is where I get all of my Hot Wheels cases. The treasure hunt for this case is Duck and Roll. And the super treasure hunt for this case is the Volkswagen Kaifer Racer. Hopefully we find one of these in this case. All right, let's go ahead and unbox it. And we'll start it off right up top right here. We'll pull out a bunch of cars and have a look at our first ones. We've got first the 2019 Mercedes-Benz A-Class in yellow. And we've got two of the Bogzillas in this brand new color. Very, very nice to see those ones, actually. I like that color. Looks good. We'll go up top again. We'll pull down. We've got the uh, Batman Akram Aslam Batmobile. Nice new color of that one. We've got the Carbonator, which you can use as a bottle opener, which is a really cool neat touch to that one. And then we also do have the brand new Mercedes-Benz A-Class in yellow. We did see that one just before. Got another one of those, nice, nice, nice. And we've got the uh, 2020 Ram Rebel right there in red. All right. We've got the brand new Lucid Air. Look at that, that is a gorgeous looking car. Brand new EV car, so that'll be fun to open up. And we do have the 20, 2005, sorry, Ford Mustang. It's a custom Ford Mustang. Got like nice Hot Wheels graphics and uh, front lip and all that good stuff on that one, so that's a neat one as well. 
We'll go up top right here. We've got the uh, Ram Rebel again, another one of those. We've got the TV series Batmobile, and we do have the 53 Chevy right there. That's a gorgeous one. I love that Chevy. Looks really nice. And we'll go up to the top right here. We've got the Mighty K in a brand new color. Check that one out. And we do have the 85 Honda City Turbo 2 in blue. And we also have the Skull Crusher right there in a nice new color as well. And, ooh, look at this. We have the treasure hunt of the case. We have Duck and Roll, a gorgeous looking gold treasure hunt. Just look at how shiny that is. Very, very nice. And you can tell uh, it will have that little logo right there underneath little treasure hunt logo in there but uh, this one from the street beast series so very nice that we got that treasure hunt for the case we'll put that one aside we did get also the custom 70 honda n600 very very tiny car new white color of that and we have the driftsta in a new color as well very cool we have the mazda repu in green right there, new color of that one. There's another one of the Skull Crushers. And we have the Kit Super Pursuit Mode car. We've seen this one as a premium. Now we get it in the main lines. I think that looks really, really cool. I like that car, very cool. And we have Alfa Romeo 8C Competizione right here. That's a brand new color. We haven't seen this car for years. It's nice to finally get that re-released in the main lines again. We have the 55 Chevy Bel Air Gasser. Check that one out. That's a nice looking one. Very cool. I love all the new colors of the Gassers that they come out with. We have the Baja Bone Shaker. That one looks to be in some sort of new matte color to that one. So that's interesting. Get a new, new color of that. What else do we have up here? We've got another one of the Skull Crushers right there. We've got the Tuned Volkswagen Golf MK1, new color of that. And a brand new casting, we have the GMC Hummer EV. Very cool, so we've got two brand new EVs in this one, the Lucid Air and the GMC Hummer EV. Love that yellow color. I'm sure we're gonna be getting in a new color like maybe a white will be coming soon because uh, white's the original color of it. But I think Hummers just look really good in yellow. So it's cool they released the yellow one first. Very nice. And it looks like we do have another one of those Hummers right down there as well. We also have the Electrac and the Mazda RX-3. That's a brand new recolor of that one. So that's an interesting looking one. Look forward to opening that one up in a future video. What else do we have down here? We have the Volvo 850 Estate in a new, looks like a new green color to that one. That's interesting, very cool. We got the TV series Batmobile again, and we've got a brand new recolor of the 1990 Acura NSX. That's a nice looking blue. I really like that, very cool. And what else do we have? We've got the uh, Ford Focus RS in it looks to be a new orange color, wow. I like that. That looks really good with the striping on the side of it, the blacked out wheels and all that. If there's another one of those Mustangs and another Ram Rebel. And we'll take out the cardboard separator here, which was coming apart. And we'll pull some cars again from the top right here. We've got the, oh, I'm dropping cars, of course. Wouldn't be a video unless I dropped something here. We've got the uh, Car de Asada right there. Car de Asada, which is basically a taco car. We've got a brand new casting, the Nissan Z Proto right there. Nissan Z Proto, Proto for prototype, I would assume. We have the Renan Rig, Renan Rig. Is that a new casting? Is this a new for 2022? No, it's not. So this is an existing casting. So I'm not too sure I remember this casting at all, but there we go the Renan rig. You guys let me know in the comments how long that one's been out. We'll grab some cars from the top again. We've got the Lane Lowrider. That's a brand new casting for this year. That is pretty neat looking. Uh, I, I don't know, I kind of like that. What do you guys think of that Lane Lowrider? We've got the Twinning and Winning, a new color of that. And we've got the Barbie Extra car. And this one is a new for 2022 casting, I believe it is. Maybe, maybe I'm just not seeing the new for 2022 in all of these, but uh, that is definitely a new one that we have right here. So there we go. We've got the, the Barbie Extra. What do you guys think of that one right there? The wings on it looks pretty cool. Cool, cool. All right, we'll put that aside and we'll see what else we have. We've got, oh wow, the Honda Civic Type R 
EK9 in yellow. Did not expect to see that one. That is very, very neat. I like that. We've got the uh, Volkswagen Kuiper Racer, and this one does not look to be the Super Treasure. This looks to be just the mainline variation of it, but still, nonetheless, that's your mainline, so good to see the mainline version. We know what that looks like now. And we do have a Volkswagen Beetle as well to add to that, so a couple of Volkswagens back to back. Nice, 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 I like that VW. What else do we have up top right here? We've got, oh, check it out. We've got the Koenigsegg Jamera. Wow, that is a pretty looking car. I love the new Koenigseggs, the Koenigsegg Jamera. Very nice to see that one. Gorgeous, love it. And we've got another one of the Batmobiles and we've got the Porsche 935. That looks to be a brand new recolor of that Porsche 935. What do you guys think of that one? Nice to see that. And what else do we have up here? We've got the 76 Greenwood Corvette. I'm a big fan of this casting. I think it looks great. So excited to see uh, one of those ones that we have right there. And we've got the uh, Barbie Extra again. There we go, another one of the Barbie Extras. And we have the Tooligan. Tooligan again. Very, very cool. Actually, no, this is the first time we've seen Tooligan in this one right here. What do you guys think of that Tooligan though? Very cool, actual tool in the back of it, which is neat. Good touch to that one. We've got a couple more up on the top right here. We're going down here. We've got the Roadster Bite right there, which is a cool one, Roadster Bite. Gotta like it. What do you guys think of the Roadster Bite right there? Looks good. We've got the uh, Alfa Romeo 8C Competizione again. There we go, another one of those. And we've got the, what is that? The 2019 Mercedes-Benz A-Class. 2019 Mercedes-Benz A-Class, so good to get one of those ones in there as well. So actually our third one for, for that one right there. We've got the uh, 53 Chevy, or sorry, 50, yeah, 55 Chevy right there as well. We have the Bogzilla and we have the Cyber Speeder right there. Cyber Speeder and the Bogzilla. So good to have some of those ones in there included. And what else do we have up top right here? We've got another one of the Batmobiles right there. Another one of those ones. Porsche 935 in black, wow. That is super cool looking. I love the new color of that. Totally blacked out. I think that looks fantastic. Very, very nice. And we do have a, what is this one right here? This is the uh, 92, uh, sorry, 87 Ford Sierra Cosworth right there. We'll go right down here, grab some cars out. We've got another one of the Mazda REPU pickup trucks. We've got the Bubble Matic and the Bricken Trails right there. Bricken Trails where you can take that piece off the top. It's got the bricks and stuff like that all around. And we'll go right down here again. We've got the Snow Stormer, Snow Stormer right there. Another Koenigsegg Jamera. Very nice to have two of those. And we have the Lotus Sport Elise in white. Check that one out. Love that. Looks fantastic. We'll put that aside. And we've got uh, the 70 Dodge Charger. We've got another one of the EV Hummers and another Batmobile, so nice to have those. And our last three cars of the case right here, we've got Bubblematic, another Lucid Air, and another 87 Ford Sierra Cosworth. Let me know in the comment section down below your favorite car from this case. Today we're unboxing the 2022 Hot Wheels H case. If you're interested in purchasing your own Hot Wheels case, check out granatoys.com. This is where I get all of my Hot Wheels cases. Their link will be in the description box below. The treasure hunt for this case is the Morris Mini, and the super treasure hunt for this case is the 2020 Jaguar F-Type. Hopefully we find at least one of those in this case. All right, let's go ahead and unbox it. We'll start it off right at the top right here for our first cars. And the first ones that we have is the Carbonator. We've got two of those right there. And we have the Shelby Cobra 427 SC. Very nice to start off those case. 
And what else do we have up top right here? First is the Tesla Roadster. This is the mainline variation. We did get one of these released as a premium. It's nice to see it in the mainlines now. We've got a, another new casting. It's the Da Vinci Veloce. I'm not sure if I pronounced that correctly. You guys can see it just right down there. But that's a interesting looking casting. I don't know what to say about that. I really like the color of it though. That looks really cool. We've got the Range Rover Classic, a brand new color of that one right there. As you can see, look at all the graphics and stuff on there. That'll be exciting to open that one up in the future. We'll go up to the top again. We've got the Kit Pursuit Mode car. We did see that one in the previous case. We have the Track Ripper and a brand new color variation. And we've got the TV series Batmobile as well. And what else do we have? We've got the Ford Mustang, 2005 Ford Mustang right there. We've got the Track Manga in a new red color. And we've got the Mazda RX-3 in black. Very cool, those are some nice ones. We have the Ford Mustang Mach-E 1400, a new color in red, that's a new color variation. And we do have some new recolors of the 20 Jeep Gladiator, white with the Borla on the side, as well as the Loco Motrin in a gold chrome. That's very cool looking, I like that gold chrome color. Nice, nice. What else do we have up here? We've got the Back to the Future time machine right here, Driftsta and the custom 70 Honda N600. Very cool, some really good cars in this case so far. What else do we have? We've got the Subaru WRX STI in a new red color. We've got the Kit Super Pursuit Mode and the custom small block. That looks to be a brand new color. And as you can see, it demos how you can take the blocks off of it, which is really, really cool. So right on the top right there. And it'll connect with Lego as well. We'll put those aside. We've got the 1990 Acura NSX in blue, Alfa Romeo 8C Competizione back, and we have the Cyber Speeder. It looks to be a brand new color variation of that one. And we'll go down right here. We've got the uh, Volkswagen Kaifer Racer. This is a mainline that did come as a super treasure hunt in the previous case. So it's nice to get one of those ones. We've got a Sh 57 Chevy in a nice, like kind of like a matte gold or even copperish color. Very cool looking. I love the color of that new one right there. And we've got the uh, GMC Hummer EV. We've seen this one previously as well, but again, nice to have another one of those. Very cool casting. We do have the 47 Chevy Fleet Line. Check out that one in the Moon Eyes edition. Very, very cool. I like that. We've got the BMW uh, R9T Racer, and that's a new for 2022 casting. Interesting bike to see that one there. We've got another one of the Mazda RX-3s, which we did see just recently. We've got the Volvo 850 Estate, and that's in a nice green color. We have Ford Focus RS, this one in orange. That looks great, looks like a really cool color. Got the stripes on the top of it. Excellent looking one, I like that. And we've got Street Cleaver, Street Cleaver right there. That looks to be a new color of Street Cleaver. And we've got three more at the bottom of the first half of the case. We've got the TV series Batmobile again. We've got the 1990 Acura NSX in blue. And we have the treasure hunt of the case, the Morris Mini. And you can see just right on the side right there, we've got the little treasure hunt logo. So you can see that. So we know that is the treasure hunt. This reminds me totally of the Mr. Bean Morris Mini. It's exact color of his. So very, very cool. Love the graphics on the side of it. Like the black belt wheels on there. Very awesome. Really, really cool to see that one. We've got the treasure hunt. Exciting, exciting. All right, we'll go down to the second half of our case right here. Pop that off and we'll grab right at the top right here. And there we go. We've got this one right here, the See Me Rollin' in green. We've got the McLaren F1 GTR Retro Racers Edition. Love the color on that one. You guys know McLaren F1, my favorite car of all time. The F1 GTR, such a fantastic casting in the Hot Wheels lineup. Uh, Volkswagen Baja Bug, that's a very cool looking one. Look at the, the colors, the wheels and stuff on that. Excellent, excellent looking, very nice. We'll go up to the top right here. We've got the Audi RS 
e-tron gt check out that brand new casting very very nice love to see that one that's from the hw green speed series very cool can't wait to open that one up we've got another new casting the 95 jeep cherokee right here check that out very popular car back in the 90s. This one's all done out. Very, very cool. Exciting to see that one. We've also got the Blade Runner. Looks to be a brand new color variation of the Blade Runner. And we'll go up to the top right here. We've got another one of these uh, Da Mincini Veloc. Again, I'm probably pronouncing that very wrong. But uh, nonetheless, I think it's pretty cool casting. We've got the Porsche 935. We've seen this one in a previous case, but very nice to have another one of those. We've got the 21 Ford Bronco, new color variation of the Bronco. I like that. Always good to see more colors of that Bronco. We've got the uh, 2020 Jaguar F Type, and this one looks to be the mainline variation of the Treasure Hunt. So this is your mainline variation of that but still nonetheless, very, very nice to have one of those. We've got the Volkswagen Kiefer Racer again. Again, a mainline variation of a Super Treasure Hunt. Another one. We've got the Koenigsegg Jamera. We did see this one in the previous case, but always good to have another one of those. Such an excellent looking casting. And we know, not very fast down the track, unfortunately. It, didn't, it lost a lot of races down the peak time racing track right there, but that's okay. Another Audi e-tron right there. Good to have another one of those, exciting. We've got two Tooligans. Looks to be a new color for the Tooligan. So two of those in a row. And what else do we have up top? We've got, oh wow, look at the color of that. Great looking 2017 Ford GT. And it looks to be in like that Miami blue color. I did not see this one coming. Definitely an excellent looking car. Wow, okay, gotta be one of the highlights for the case right there for a great recolor. We've got uh, the Lotus Sport Elise and a Ford Focus RS. Again, we saw those ones previously. And we'll go up to the top. We've got a 67 Ford GT40 Mark IV. This looks to be a new color variation of that one in white. We've got the Cyber Speeder and a Blade Runner. Two more of those ones right there. We've got the custom 70 Honda N600. We already saw that. Track Manga, another one of those. And another one of the new casting, the 95 Jeep Cherokee. Very cool to have an extra one of those ones as well. we'll grab right here. We've got the Electrac. That is an interesting one. It's got the, it's the X Racer edition, so we can see right through it for that one. BMW R9T Racer. There's another one of those. We got one of those before. We've got the Sweet Driver. It looks to be a new color of that one. We've gotten many different uh, recolors, and this is a brand new casting for this year. So they're really pushing out all the, the recolors of Sweet Driver. Seems to be a popular casting, though. I really like it. It's an interesting new casting for this year. We've got uh, Snow Stormer right here. It looks to be a new color of Snow Stormer. Uh, Lotus Sport Elise and the Koenigsegg Jamera. Two more of those ones right there. And what else do we have that just came out? We've got the Porsche 935, another one of those ones. Very nice. What else do we have? The Lucid Air, there we go. So we did see this one, I believe, in the previous case, but uh, I'm a big fan of this casting. I think it looks really good in Hot Wheels format. Another one of those 57 Chevys in that nice matte color. Great to have an extra one of those ones as well. We've got three more cars at the very bottom of our case so far. We've got the TV series Batmobile, the 70 Dodge Charger, and the Billy Goat. Comment down below, guys, which was your favorite car from this case. Today, we're unboxing the 2022 Hot Wheels J case. If you wanna get your own Hot Wheels cases like the one that you see here, check out granatoys.com. This is where I get all of my Hot Wheels cases. The link is in the description box below. The treasure hunt for this case is gotta go. And the super treasure hunt for this case is the custom 2018 Ford Mustang GT. Hopefully we find one of those in this case. Let's go ahead and unbox it. And we'll start it up top right here. And we'll see some of the cars that we pull out first. First up, we've got the Kick Cart and the Loco Motorin, as well as Rocket Box. Some fantasy cars for our start here. And we'll go ahead and grab up here. We've got Bully Goats. 
We've got the Track Ripper and a brand new for 2022 casting. This is the Automobilia Pinifarina Batista. A very cool looking exotic car. I'm very excited to open this one up. I think it looks fantastic. All right, we'll put that aside for now and we'll go ahead and grab some more. We've got the 21 Ford Bronco right there. That's a new color. Track Ripper and the Nissan Skyline 2000 GTR Liberty Walk Edition. Check that one out. Does that not look amazing with a wide body on there? Very, very cool new casting. Excited to have that one. We'll go ahead and put that aside. We've got the MST Suzuka right here. I think that's a new one. I haven't seen that one before that I remember. We've got the Bricken Speed. That is a new one as well. Check that one out. This obviously does have like the pieces that remove on here and you can put different types of blocks on there, the mega blocks and Lego on there. So that's interesting. We'll have to open that one up in a future video and see. We've got the 67 Ford GT40 Mark IV. Very cool in that new white color. And we'll go up top right here. McLaren F1 GTR. Absolutely love this casting. We saw it in the previous case, but nice to have another one of those. We've got Blade Run Raider and Kick Cart again as well. And we've got another Pinaferina Batista in that yellow. We've got the Gotta Go, and is this the treasure hunt of the case? I believe this one is. We'll have a closer look at it. And yes, this is the treasure hunt for the case. So very cool that we got the treasure hunt for the case. There is a little treasure hunt logo just on the side that you can just barely see just up the front right there. But nonetheless, very cool to find a treasure hunt in the case. We've got another Loco Motorin in that gold chrome color. Put those aside. We've got Coupe Clip in a brand new color. A nice red color of that one right there. That's a fantastic looking red color. I really, really do like that one. We've got the Volkswagen Baja Bug and a new recolor of the 94 Bugatti EV110 SS. I love that casting. Very cool. We saw it in yellow initially. We got a blue one. Uh, and now we have the very cool looking gray. Awesome, love it. I've seen that car in real life way back when it first came out. And we have the Audi RS e-tron GT. We have a 2020 Jaguar F-Type, and this is the mainline variation of the Super Treasure Hunt from the H case. So that's just your nice mainline, looks good. We've got the Track Manga. Very nice looking, new color of that one. And we've got another one of the Jaguars. And we have a Honda Super Cub. Honda Super Cub, okay, that's definitely an interesting casting. And then we have the 1970 Pontiac Firebird. This is from the Hot Wheels Legends Tour. Uh, we ha had it in white initially, now we've got this new recolor in red. So very cool to have that one right there. And this is already coming off right here. We'll actually just take that out even though we haven't got to the second half of the case. We'll grab this out right here. We've got the Shelby Cobra 427SC. I really like that. Another McLaren F1 GTR and another Volkswagen Baja Bug. And to our last row right here, custom 2019, sorry, 2018 Ford Mustang GT. This looks to be the main line of the Super Treasure Hunt. That's not the Super at all, but very cool to have the mainline variation of it. We've got Track Manga, and we've got the 95 Jeep Cherokee, and this is a new casting that was released in the H case, but very cool that we're getting this one carried over into this one right here. And what else do we have on the bottom? We've got the Back to the Future Time Machine. We saw that one in the previous case as well. Range Rover Classic and the Coupe Clip. Again, another one of those ones. There we go. I'll put those aside and we'll go up to the second half of our case right here. We'll grab from the top. We've got Fast Gassin. It looks to be a new recolor of that. Sweet Driver. There we go. And the Ford Mustang Mach-E 1400 in red. That's a recolor that we saw in the previous case, but good to have another one of those ones. And up at the very top on this side, 
We've got Brick and Speed again. We've got the Track Ripper again and another Locomotorin. I've got a lot of these Locomotorins between this case and the previous case. They just seem to like put a lot of those ones in there, but that's okay. We'll grab from the top. We've got the 47 Chevy Fleet Line. The 2017 Ford GT in this nice Miami blue color. Absolutely love this casting. Saw it in the previous case. And we also saw the Tesla Roadster in the previous case as well. But two fantastic castings. I absolutely love these. And happy to have some extras of those ones, definitely. And we'll go up right here. We've got, it looks to be a new casting, the 86 Toyota van, check that one out. I mean, I never thought I'd like a Toyota van, but it definitely does look really, really cool. It's a great job that they've done at that casting. We've got the 21 Ford Bronco, 2021 Ford Bronco, and the Audi RS e-tron GT again. So we saw those ones previously. We'll grab right up here. The Shelby 427 SC Cobra. Here we go. The Dodge Dart looks to be an Art Cars one with all the funky colors on it. And See Me Rolling in that green color. We've seen this one in the previous couple of cases there. What do we have up here? We've got another one of the Ford Mustang Mach-E 1400s in that new recolor. This one, Turbine Sublime. I believe this is a new casting. I'm not 100% sure. But that's definitely one that I don't remember seeing before. We've got the Range Rover Classic again. There we go, that new recolor of that one. I'll put those aside. We've got the Da Mincini Veloc right there. So a Velocci, I'm not sure if I pronounced that correctly. Again, we saw this one in the previous case. There's that Ford GT Mark IV. And we've got the Velasa Racer. It looks to be a new color of the Velasa Racer right there. I'll go ahead and put that aside. And what else do we have? There's another one of the Toyota vans. We also have the Subaru WRX STI and the Ford Mustang Mach-E 1400. We've seen those ones previously as well. And we've got, ooh, looks to be a nice new one right here. We've got a couple of the Mod Rod, brand new color variation of the Mod Rod. Check that one out. Brand new, amazing looking casting. We've got the LB Lamborghini Huracan Coupe, the Liberty Walk Lamborghini Huracan Coupe. Look at that. What a great looking casting. Looks so, so good. Cannot wait to open that one up. We've got the 2020 Jeep Gladiator in white. We did see this one previously, but nice to have another one of those. Getting to the bottom right here. We've got the Volkswagen Baja Bug. Another one of those. And a, another Tesla Roadster and another Ford GT, 2017 Ford GT. So we got, we're getting lots of those ones now, but hey, I'm not gonna complain. I absolutely love those ones. Getting to the bottom. Fast Fish. Looks to be a recolor in white. The 95 Mazda RX-7 Falcon Edition. And we've got a recolor of another Liberty Walk car, the Liberty Works uh, GT Nissan R35. Uh, I mean, you can just read it. It's like the longest names car right there. So you can see that one right there. That looks to be a nice uh, Hot Wheels Edition recolor of that one right there. Very, very cool. And our last three cars of the case that we have. We've got the GT Scorcher, and we've got the classic TV series Batmobile, looks to be the tuned out variation, and another Mustang Mach-E 1400. Let me know in the comment section down below which was your favorite car from this case. Today we're unboxing the 2022 Hot Wheels K case. If you wanna get your own Hot Wheels cases like the one that you see right here, you can check out granatoys.com. This is where I get all of my Hot Wheels cases. I will link them in the description box below. The treasure hunt for this case is the 1987 Dodge D100, and the super treasure hunt for this case is the Nissan Skyline HT 2000 GTX. Hopefully we find one of those in this case. Let's go ahead and unbox it. And we'll start it off right up top right here. We'll grab the cars that are sticking right out. And the first one that we have is the Nissan Skyline 2000 GTR Liberty Walk Edition. Then we've got the classic TV series Batmobile and the Count Muscula. It looks like a new color of that one right there. And we'll go ahead and grab up top. We've got the custom 2018 Ford Mustang GT. 
the Liberty Walk Silhouette Works GT Nissan 35 GTR R version to Hot Wheels variation. We've got the Rocket Box as well. Very nice, good start to the case so far. We've got the 68 Dodge Dart, the MST Suzuka, and we've got a new color of Ragin' Express. And we've got the Bugatti EB110 SS. That's the new color we saw in the previous case. We do have the Batmobile, looks like a new color of that. And the Ain't Fair looks to be a new color of Ain't Fair as well. Very nice, good start. I like it, I like it. We've got the 2006 Pontiac GTO, new color of that one. And a brand new casting, I've been looking forward to this one right here. This is the Porsche 911 GT3. This is the brand new variation of the 911 GT3. Love the wing on this one and I love the look. Great looking car. We've got a new color of Glory Chaser right there below that as well. And what else do we have? We've got the 65 Mustang 2 Plus 2 Fastback. We've got the Mod Rod and GT Scorcher right there. Fast Fish in white. There's another one of those Nissan Skyline 2000 GTR Liberty Walk Editions. And the 1970 Pontiac Firebird Hot Wheels Legends Tour winner car. That's a recolor in red. And we've got the Coupe Clip, a new recolor of that one. And we've got a recolor of the 20 Toyota Tacoma, also in red. And there is that Firebird again. Lots of red recolors I've been noticing lately. So there you go, there's three red recolors right there. But nonetheless, red is a great color, so why not? Speaking of red recolors, we've got the Skull Shaker in a new red recolor. There's another one of those Batmobiles and another one of those Liberty Walk Nissan GTRs. We've got another Porsche 911 GT3, the GT Scorcher, and what is this? We've got the Armadillo, Armadillo, and uh, this is from the Disney Pixar Lightyear, but that is pretty crazy. I don't know what to say about that. Definitely looks like an interesting casting. Can't wait to open that one up in a future video. And we'll go ahead and grab what we have here. We've got the uh, 1986 Toyota Van. Nice new casting, we saw that one in the previous case. We've got the treasure hunt of the case. Awesome find, the 87 Dodge D100. What a great looking treasure hunt this is. One of the nicest treasure hunts I've seen in a while. There's your treasure hunt logo just on the back right there. So we know for sure it is a treasure hunt, but wow, great looking one. Very, very excited to have that one. There's another one of the armadillos as well. We'll put those aside. And to the bottom of the first half of our case right here, we've got another coupe clip, another one of the Bugatti EV110 Super Sports, and the Mod Rod again as well. We'll take that paper out and we'll grab at the top right here. Oh, look at that. The McLaren F1 in orange. Love the color. Obviously, McLaren F1 being my favorite car of all time. What a fantastic looking new recolor. We've got the head gasket right below that. That's a new recolor as well. And look at this one right here. This is called the HW Kit Concept. And you may think this looks familiar. It looks like a vector casting that came out several years ago. It's almost like Hot Wheels reused the vector casting and they called it the HW Kit Concept. So interesting new car, quote unquote new, possibly, but we'll have to open that one up in a future video. We'll grab some more cars from the top right here. We've got, ooh, look at that recolor. Another red recolor, of course, but it's the Copo Camaro, 1969 Copo Camaro. That one looks fantastic. Really, really like that one. We've got the Kick Cart, and there's another one of the Toyota Tacoma recolors as well. And we had a couple cars drop right here. Oh, look at that, the Corvette C8R. What a great looking recolor of that one as well. Wow, so nice looking, love that. Uh, we've got the Turbine Sublime. I think we saw this one in the previous case, if I'm not mistaken, but that's, a, that's an interesting looking casting as well. 
And one more up here that uh, was part of that row, we had the Batmobile. And we'll grab these ones right here. We've got the LB Works Huracan Coupe, Lamborghini Huracan Coupe. We saw that one in the previous case, but nice to have another one of those. Also another uh, custom Ford Mustang GT. Um, and this, is this a treasure? No, this is not a super treasure hunt. I thought for a second we might have got a super treasure hunt, but this is the mainline variation of the super treasure hunt for the Nissan Skyline HT2000 GTX. There we go, we look in the bottom just to make sure, yeah, it is just the mainline variation, it's not the Super. But hopefully we still have a chance of finding the Super in this case, you never know. We'll go ahead and grab from the top right here. Cosmic Coupe right there, that looks to be a new recolor of that. We've got the, the Brick and Speed, we saw that one in the previous case. And Hyper Rocker looks to be a new color of that. And we'll go ahead and grab some more. There's another one of those uh, HW kit concept cars. Uh, recolor of the Aston Martin V12 Speedster. That's like a pearl white color. That's a great looking recolor, I really like that. Uh, Velociraptor, any new color as well. I'll put those aside, we'll grab what else we have here. We've got the classic TV series of Batmobile, another one of those, and check this out. Wow, that is so cool. The LB Super Silhouette Nissan Silvia S15 Liberty Walk Edition right there. Great color of that one as well. Really, really like that one. Uh, the MST Suzuka, again, another one of those. And what else do we have here? Oh, we've got a new recolor of the 84 Audi Sport Quattro in yellow. Love that. There's the 95 Mazda RX-7. We saw that one in the previous case. And we've got the 40 Ford Pickup. Check that one out. Looks like it's fully ready in dragster format. Very nice. And what else do we have? We've got uh, another kick cart. We've got the wheelie chair. Looks to be a new color of that one. And the Honda Super Cab. I believe we saw that one in the previous case as well, but we've got another one of those. And we've got the Da Vincinator. I always think I pronounced that wrong. We've got that one in a new recolor. Ford Mustang GT Concept Track Patrol and another one of the Liberty Walk Lamborghini Huracans as well. And we're getting to the bottom here. Oops, I'm dropping cars. All right, let's pick up the one we dropped here. We dropped a 95 Mazda RX-7. We already saw one of those. There is the Automobilia Pinaferina Batista. Seen that in the previous case, but very, very nice car. Absolutely loving that. Uh, Fast Gassin, it looks to be a new recolor of that one. And our last three cars at the bottom of the case right here. We've got the Fast Fish. We've got a new Twin Mill recolor. Let's have a closer look at that. Great looking recolor of that one and another classic TV series Batmobile tuned out edition. Comment down below your favorite car from this case. Let's go ahead and unbox the 2022 Hot Wheels L case. I get all of my cases from Grana Toys. If you wanna get your own Hot Wheels cases like I do sent to you each month, then check out granatoys.com. Links in the description box below. The treasure hunt for this case is the 58 Impala and the super treasure hunt for this case is the 71 Lamborghini Mira L. SV. Hopefully we find one of these in this case. All right, let's go ahead and unbox it. And we'll start it up at the top right here. We'll grab our first three cars out. And first up, we've got the Dodge Challenger SRT Demon with the Ram Chers or Ram Chargers on the side of it. Kind of an interesting colorway. Then we've got the Lamborghini Cyan right here. Brand new casting. I absolutely love this one. I cannot wait to open this one up. Great looking casting. We've got the Ragin' Express in the gold color. I think we saw that one in the previous case. We'll go ahead up top right here. We've got the uh, Fusion Busta, we've got Ain't Fair, and we've got the Batmobile. Very nice. Good start to the case so far. We've got the McLaren Elva, a brand new McLaren casting. 
Very cool to have that one. We've got a new colorway of the Honda S2000, a nice glossy red color. And we've got Count Muscula. And up top, we've got the Honda C Civic Custom right here. That's an interesting colorway, I like that. We've got the Mazda RX-7, and we've got 40 Ford Pickup. Nice drag stirt right there. 65 Ford Mustang 2 Plus 2 Fastback, the Pontiac GTO, and there is that Porsche 911 GT3, my favorite casting from the previous case. Absolutely love that one, good to have a double of that. And up top right here, we've got the Glory Chaser. I'm not sure if that's a new color or not. Interesting, I like that, that SF on the side. Scudera Ferrari, no, <laughs> I don't think so, but interesting that it's got the SF. If you know what it stands for, let me know. Uh, we've got the 84 Audi Sport Quattro in yellow, and we've got a Lethal Diesel. Looks to be a new colorway of that one. All right. We've got Sand Runner. That's an interesting color. I like the matte black finish in that. Very cool. Uh, we've got Twin Mill and another one of those Honda Civic Customs right there. We've got another McLaren F1 in orange. I did get this one in our previous case as well, but good to have another one of those. As you guys know, my favorite car of all time. Uh, Nissan Skyline HT2000 GTX. And what is this? This is an interesting new casting, I believe. Uh, actually, maybe not. I think this one is not a new casting. The Hot Wheels Rapid Response, the ambulance one. That's just a new colorway, not a new casting. Interesting though. And uh, another Batmobile. Uh, we've got the Dodge Challenger Drift car. So another Challenger, but this time it's the Drift variation. 426 for the Hemi motor on the side of it. Uh, we've got the Nissan Leaf Nismo edition. That's a new colorway of that one. Very nice to have extras of those. And uh, we've got the head gasket right there. Uh, we've got the 2015 Dodge Challenger SRT EMS written on the side of it. That's a nice matte finish color to it. And we've got the Armadillo, which we saw in the previous case as well. And what else do we have down here? Aston Martin V12 Speedster in white. Uh, Dodge Viper RT10, this is a very classic old casting. It's been around for a long time. We've got many, many different recolors of it, but I love it. I love the Dodge Viper, great looking car. We also have the tuned out Skull Crusher right there. Awesome, or Skull Shaker, my bad, Skull Shaker, not Skull Crusher, Skull Shaker. All right, we got a couple of cars right here. We've got the Hot Wired, Hot Wired. Not a new casting, but that's one I haven't seen for a long time. Hot wired, okay. And there's the 58 Impala, and this is the treasure hunt for the case. I believe it is the treasure hunt. Yes, it is. It does have the little treasure hunt logo um, right there, so there we go. I don't know if, uh, do we have the treasure hunt logo written somewhere on here? Um, not that I see. We'll have to open it up, but I do know this is the treasure hunt, because if we look behind the casting, you can see the little treasure hunt logo right behind there, but when we open it up, we'll get a better look at it and see it. But there we go, good to have the treasure hunt for the case. Go down to the bottom. Let's see what else we have up top right here. Another McLaren F1, love it. Uh, we've got the 69 Copo Camaro and the Hyper Rocker. All right. And we've got the head gasket, the uh, Ain't Fair again, and another McLaren Elva. Love the McLaren Elva, I think it's a cool looking car. Good to have some extras of those. We do have the Lamborghini Mira SV, but this looks to be the mainline variation of it, not the Super Josh Hunt, but still good that we got the mainline variation. I think it's a great looking casting. Uh, we've got the uh, LB uh, Super Silhouette, Nissan Silva, the Liberty Walk Silva, and we've got the Corvette C8R. We did see those ones in the previous case, but the Mira, very nice to have that. And we've got Nissan Skyline HT2000 GTX, the Batmobile again, and look at the wheels on this. That's an interesting wheel design on that. 69 Dodge Charger 500, it's got these classic style wheels. I don't know, I kinda like it. I kinda like it like that. I think it's interesting to see it like that. Very cool. 
All right, we'll put those aside. And we've got a couple more here. Oh, we've still got several more. Uh, 40 Ford Pickup, another one of those Nissan uh, Silhouette Silvia S15s, and the 68 El Camino. That's an interesting colorway, Speed Shop. It says on the side of that one, very cool. And our next three right here, we've got the 70 Chevelle SS Wagon. That is a cool looking wagon right there. We've got a, another one of the 84 Audi Sport Quattro's in yellow and another Glory Chaser. Then we've got, oh, we've got that new kit car, that HW kit concept. We did see that in the previous case, but I really, really like that car. Very cool looking. We've got the Cosmic Coupe and a Hyper Rocker in orange. And what else do we have? We've got the, uh, <laughs> I always get this wrong. Devensinator? Devensinator. I think that's what it is. Devensinator. Uh, we've got the Aston Martin V12 Speedster and another of the Count Muscula. Getting down here, we've got the Wheelie Chair, another one of the Devensinators, and we've got the uh, X34 Land Speeder. Not a big fan of that casting. Uh, I think it's a screen time. It's a movie car, Star Wars car. Yeah. Eh, don't really care for it. Not my thing. All right, we'll go down here. We've got the uh, Turtle Shell right there. I don't know if that's a new color or not. We do have a new color, though, of the Nissan Z Proto. Very cool. Nice new white color with the gold wheels. And we've got the Ford Mustang GT Concept car. And our last row right here. We've got the 65 Mustang 2 Plus 2 Fastback followed with the Copo Camaro and then followed by the Cruise Bruiser. So a bunch of muscle type cars right there. And our last three cars down at the bottom, we've got, uh, looks like the Barbie Extra. Is this a, a new color of the Barbie Extra? I mean, they all kind of look the same. Might just be new wheels. I can't remember what the last one looked like. Uh, Twin Mill and another of the Lamborghini Cyan. So let's just have a nice look at that. That is just a thing of beauty. I cannot wait to open that one up, guys. Let me know in the comment section down below which was your favorite car from this case. Let's go ahead and unbox the 2022 Hot Wheels M case. I get all of my Hot Wheels from Granite Toys. If you want to get your own Hot Wheels cases sent to you, check out GranitToys.com. Links in the description box below. The treasure hunt for this case is the HW Warp Speeder, and the super treasure hunt for this case is the 84 Mustang SVO. Let's see if we can find one of those in in this case. All right, let's go ahead and unbox it. And we'll start at the top right here. We'll pull out our first three cars. And there we have right away our treasure hunt, the HW Warp Speeder. Look at that. What a great first car. I think that means there's gonna be a lot of good luck in this case. We'll put that aside. Next, we've got the uh, we've got the Hot Wired. That's a new casting. And Astro Rat looks to be a new color of that one right there. Up top, we've got the Drifta, the Dodge Viper RT10, and we've got a Supra, the Toyota Supra from the Then and Now series. Check that out, great looking new car. And what else do we have? We've got the 82 Corvette Gasser. Wow, that is amazing. I think that's a new casting. I don't think I've seen that one before. HW Drag Strip Series. And there we have the 2015 Dodge Charger SRT. And we've got the Snow Stormer right there in a new color variation. And we'll go right to here. We've got the Nissan Leaf. There's that electric race car right there. And we've got the 2005 Ford Mustang and the Dodge Challenger Drift Car. Great start to this case. I'm loving it so far. We've got HW Rapid Response, the Lightning Bug. That's an interesting one. I think that's a new casting. I don't remember seeing that one before. Interesting. We've got the Sand Burner as well. And we've got the Nissan Maxima Drift Car. Check that out. 
That is definitely a new casting. I've not seen that one before from HW Wagons. Right below it, we've got the Mazda RX-7 and another Hot Wired. And we've got, ooh, the new color of the Koenigsegg Jamera. Check that out. Great looking new orange color of the Koenigsegg Jamera. I cannot wait to open that one up. What a great looking casting, nice new recolor of it. There's another Dodge Viper RT10. And we've got the Lethal Diesel right there. That looks to be a new color of Lethal Diesel. And we've got the Layin Lowrider. Check that out. That is a cool casting as well. We've got the Sand Burner and there's another one of those 1962 Corvette Gassers. Love that casting. Cannot wait to open one of those ones up as well. And we've got another Mazda RX-7, another one of the 2015 Dodge Challenger SRTs, and a nice looking art car, the custom 69 Chevy pickup. Check out the color on that one right there. Just check out the card right there. That is crazy. But I love the color on that one. Even with the different colored wheel tire combination, looks great. All right, we'll put those aside. We've got the Honda Civic Custom. We saw that one in our previous case. That's a nice new casting. Ooh, we've got a new color of Cyber Speeder. Check that one out. White on the top with the black and red. Looking really, really good. And speaking of a nice new red color, we've got the Honda S2000 in a very glossy looking red color. We saw this one in the previous case, but I love it. Just such a clean looking design on this one right here. All right, we'll put those ones aside and we'll go We've got Fusion Busta. That's a new color of Fusion Busta. What is that? Is that like a, it's almost like a satin green color. It's an interesting color to that one. We've got the Batman Akram Aslam Batmobile. I know I always pronounce that wrong. You guys will make fun of me in the comments, but there you go. <laughs> and we've got the 69 El Camino as well. We saw that one in the previous case. We'll put those ones aside. And our last three cars for the first half right here. The Lamborghini Cyan. We saw this one in the previous case. Love it. We've already opened one up. Really, really cool looking car. Speaking of another one we saw in the previous case as well, it's the 2018 Dodge Challenger SRT Demon and a new color of the Lotus Sport Elise. This is a nice new yellow color. We saw this one recently released in white. Now we've got that recolor in the yellow. Love yellow, my favorite color. You guys know that. Let's go to the bottom of the case. See, there's tons of more interesting cars in this one right here. We'll pull this on out. Oh, there's the Donut Drifter. It's a new color of that one. And we've got the Lancia Delta Integrale. This one in black with those kind of classic looking wheel tire combination. I've been a big fan of this casting. Really like all the color variations they have of it. Now we've got these different wheels. I'm not sure if these wheels really suit the car or not. I kind of like the 10 spokes better, but the new black with 10 interior looks good. There's Tardo Shell as well. A nice new color of that one. And what else do we have up top right here? Looks like we've got some good ones here. We've got the uh, X34 Land Speeder. Not a big fan of that casting actually. This is that, that Star Wars iteration right here. Uh, we've got the Nissan Z Proto right there. That's a new color in white with the gold wheels, the black top. And there's our 71 Lamborghini Mura SV. This one is uh, the main line, but they do make it as a super treasure hunt for the L case of 2022. Unfortunately, we didn't get that one in our L case, but that's all right. We've got two of the Barbie extra cars. Check those out. Very, very interesting castings. And then we've got the Cruise Bruiser right here. That's a nice new color of Cruise Bruiser. We'll have to open that one up and in our next video probably. There's another one of the Batmobiles and a Nissan Leaf Nismo Edition and the McLaren Elva. Very cool. I love this new McLaren Elva. We have opened one up already in our previous case. Put those on that side. We've got the uh, 70 Chevelle SS Wagon, and there's another one of the Lightning Bugs. I believe this one would be glow in the dark. It, it definitely does look like the glow in the dark style, so I'll have to test that one out in a future video. Uh, we got the Honda S2000 again. Nice, getting another good double of that, that one right there. We'll go right to here. We've got, there is that Nissan Maxima Drift car again. I just look at the wheels. I actually didn't notice the wheels before, but check out, there's some new wheels on there. That's interesting. I wonder if those will continue in the Hot Wheels lineup. 
nice uh, kind of three spokes and then they've got like the little staggers in them so they're actually like six spokes interesting i like it i like it uh we've got the volvo 850 estate in gloss black with gray wheels very very clean looking color of that one and there's another one of these 68 l caminos all right and we've got turtle shell again there it is we've got the 69 camaro convertible that's a very nice looking one very clean that's a black color as well with some white striping on it and then we've got the newer age wheels on there the Krager mags on there very nice i like that uh lethal diesel as well there's another one of those ones and we'll go down right here oh what do we have here we've got uh, fusion busta again another nissan z proto and a recolor of the gmc hummer ev and this is this is an interesting one it's kind of like a a dark burnt orange that's a great new color to that. I like it. I like it. I like to see that. We're going to probably see definitely a lot more recolors of this Hummer EV, but uh, it's a nice addition to the Hot Wheels lineup. So we'll look forward to more of those recolors in the future. Uh, we've got the Supercharged, a dragster. Check that out. Even the big Supercharged on the side of it. Very, very cool dragster. I love that one. We've got the, uh, what is this? A 2018 Camaro SS. Nice green metallic color. And the HW Rapid Response Ambulance. All right. And we're getting down here. We've got the McLaren Elva again. Uh, there is the tuned Chevy Silverado. That looks to be a new recolor of that one. We saw that one in blue previously. Very nice. And we've got another medic car. This is the Rescue Duty. It's kind of an older casting, but we're seeing a new recolor of that one. It's got the black top, the yellow bottom. Nice, looks good, I like it, looks really good. All right, let's see what else we got on our last row right here. We've got another one of the Batmobiles. I think that's a third one in this case. There's another one of the Lamborghini Mira SVs. And we've got the 84 Mustang SVO. This is the main line though. This is not the super treasure hunt, but Wow, I'm very impressed with this casting though. Check out the detail on it on the side, the striping, the front, there's that scoop. This is actually very, very impressive and it's got some good weight to it as well, which I was not expecting, but that's definitely, I like that one. Probably one of my favorites of this case, even though it's not the super, it's a very, very good looking casting, very nicely designed. All right, our last three cars of the case. We have got the Dodge Challenger Drift car again. We've got the Electro Silhouettes, and we've got the 69 Dodge Charger 500. Guys, comment section down below which one of these cars that you've seen in this case have you found in store. Let's go ahead and unbox the 2022 Hot Wheels N case. I get all of my cases from Granite Toys, so if you want to get your own Hot Wheels cases sent to you every time a new one comes out, check out GranitToys.com. Links in the description box below. The treasure hunt for this case is the 98 Subaru Impreza 22B STI version, and the super treasure run for this case is the 94 Audi Avant RS2. Hopefully we can find at least one of those in this case. Let's go ahead and unbox it. And we'll start right at the top right here. We'll grab our cars out and check that out right away. And we'll start right at the top right here. We'll grab our cars out and check that out right away. We've got the treasure hunt. There is the Subaru uh, Impreza 22B STI. And if we look at it very closely, we can see just right here, we've got that little treasure hunt logo just on there. But wow, that's a great looking casting. Really, really like that. I love the original blue one that it came out with, but now we're getting these different colors of it and it looks really good. Then we've got the Max Steel. And I think that's a brand new casting. I don't think I've ever seen that one before interesting kind of like a 30s hot rod uh, we've got the astro rats and we'll go right up to the top right here we've got drifta and the uh da, da vinci Veloc. i know i always say that wrong but it uh, looks like a new color of that we originally saw it in blue now we've got this kind of maroonish red color of it there we have the toyota supra looking good and we've got the Corvette C6R. That is very cool. This is from the then and now. So we saw the now variation, which was the Corvette C8R. 
which we saw, I think it was last case or the case before. So very cool, we got the same color variation now in that. We got a brand new casting, the Lotus Evaya right here. Check out that crazy hypercar. Very, very cool. Very cool to have that one from the Hot Wheels Exotics. Then we've got Snow Stormer. And we've got the 68 Mercury Cougar in a nice new blue color. 2005 Ford Mustang. There we go. Nice and customized out. And another Astro Rat. And up top, we've got the Lightning Bug. The glow in the dark one. Very, very cool. Another one of the Max Steels. And the Batman Batmobile right there. Look at that new color of that one. Very, very nice. And we've got the Nissan Maxima Drift car. We saw this race down the track. It's very, very fast. If you haven't seen that video, go check out my other videos. Uh, we've got the Range Rover Classic. That looks to be a nice new color variation. Expedition written on the back of it from the uh, Mud Studs series. Then we've got the 2019 Chevy Silverado Trail Boss LT with the big Borla on the side of it. Nice new color variation of that one. And we've got the Koenigsegg Jamera. There's that new orange color we saw in the previous case. Then we've got a brand new casting, the Pagani Zonda R. Wow, that is amazing looking. Just check that out. It's kind of like a matte black finish, gold wheels on there. Look at that diffuser and wing on there. What a great looking casting. I cannot wait to open this one up. We'll open this one in the next video, but looks great. Then we've got a new color of the 90 Acura NSA. Nice, uh, looks like a lime green color of that one. Very cool, I like that. We'll put those aside. Then we've got the 2015 Challenger SRT. I don't know if this is the Demon or not. Looks like just the, oh no, it's just the 2015, so it wouldn't be the Demon, but that's a cool, uh, I like the graphics and stuff on the side of that, looks good. Then we've got the 62 Corvette Gasser, and followed by Lane Lowrider. We saw those ones previous case, but good to have extras of those. We've got the tuned out 83 Chevy Silverado right there. Then we've got the 47 Chevy Fleet line with the Moon Eyes edition. We've got a Hot Wheels art car, the custom uh, 69 Chevy pickup truck. There we go. It's good case so far. Really liking this one. Uh, we've got five alarm and that is an interesting color for a five alarm. Looks like a nice bright pink color on there. Very cool, okay, interesting. Uh, another tuned out Chevy Silverado and another one of the Chevy pickup art cars. We'll put those aside. We've got another Batman Batmobile. Then we've got the Lucid Air in a brand new white color. Check that out. We saw this one previously released in silver. Now we've got the white. I think it's a great looking casting. Then we've got the Altered Ego Hot Wheels Racing Team Edition. Love the colorway of that, very, very cool. Next up, we've got uh, the Water Bomber, new color of that one, Lotus Sport Elise. We saw that one before in the yellow in the previous case. Velocita with uh, some crazy graphics on the side. Looks like some sort of piranha or something on the side. That is, okay, that's odd. Interesting to see though. All right, that's the bottom, or the top half. Now we're going to the bottom half of our case and we'll pull out some cards from the top right here. We've got the Lancia Delta Integrale in black. We've got the Cyber Speeder. And wow, that's an interesting color of the TV series Batmobile. Okay, normally we see it in black, but we've got this nice bright color. That is pretty cool. I did not expect to see a color of a Batmobile like that, but that's, that's neat to have. We'll go on to the top right here. Uh, two more Batmobiles. There's the same ones that we just saw but uh, we've got some doubles of those ones and then followed up by another one of the Lotus Avias right there. What do you guys think of that new casting, the Lotus Avaya? Uh, I'm not a huge fan of the color. Uh, I would like to see it in uh, a brighter color maybe just to see, you can see the lines of it a little bit better, but nonetheless, still a very cool casting. Happy to have it. Grab a bunch more cars out here. We've got the Toyota Supra, another one of the Pagani Zonda Rs, and the Koenigsegg Jamera. So look at those three amazing castings right there that we pulled out at the same time. All right, what else do we have? We've got the Donut Drifter. There's two of them right there, and that's followed by, it looks like, looks like, a, is this a new casting? I think it is the BMW R9T Racer. I I think we saw this one before in a different color. I can't remember exactly, uh, but that's part of the Retro Racer series. So it's an interesting BMW. 
Then we've got another one of the Nissan Drift cars right there. Again, very fast car down the track. New colorway of the Big Air Bel Air. And we've got a new colorway of the 71 Dodge Charger. You definitely know this is a 71 Dodge Charger. Look at that on the side right there. 71 Dodge Charger. It's just telling you exactly what it is. You'll never forget what that car is. <laughs> and next up, we've got the Low Lux. Uh, which we saw this one before. I think it was released in a red. Now we've got a new color of that one. There is the Volvo 850 Estate, and that is followed by the Volvo 240 Drift Wagon. Wow, just check, just check out the two Volvos. I mean, that's your normal Volvo, and that is your done out Drift Wagon. That is crazy. I love all these new drift cars that they're coming out with to the Hot Wheels line. That looks fantastic. Excited to open that one up in a future video. Uh, Twin Mill 3. Twin Mill 3. Just check that out. Is that a... I can't remember if that's a brand new Twin Mill 3. Is that a brand new casting? I think it is. I like it. It looks good. We've got the Shelby Cobra 427 SC. A nice yellow with the Hot Wheels logos on there. And then followed by the 69 Camaro convertible. Nice, classy looking, clean convertible right there. And then we've got the Electro Silhouette, followed by the Supercharged Dragster, and then the GMC Hummer EV. Very nice, three good cars right there. We've got tuned 83 Chevy Silverado, followed by the Camaro SS, 2018 Camaro SS, and another Hummer EV. Getting down to our bottom here, Velocita, another supercharged, and the Rescue Duty with the big medic on the side of it. And our bottom row, we've got the Lotus Sport Elise, the 94 Mustang SVO, and we've got the Audi RS2 Avant, and this one is not the supercharger on. This just looks like the standard variation, so it's got the classic wheels, but still, I think that looks very, very good. Great detail on the front and back, those classic style wheels on there. Looks absolutely fantastic. I'm really liking that. Uh, and our last three cars of the case, we have got Electro Silhouette, another one of those. There's another one of the uh, Drift Wagon Volvos and another one of those new colored TV series Batmobiles. Guys, let me know in the comment section down below your favorite car from this case. What's up, Peak Timers? Let's unbox the Hot Wheels P case. I get all of my cases from Grana Toys. If you want to get a new Hot Wheels case sent to you each time a new one comes out, check out granatoys.com. Links in the description box below. The regular treasure hunt for this case is Muscle and Blowin', and the super treasure hunt for this case is the 32 Ford. Hopefully, we find one of these in this case. All right, let's go ahead and unbox it. The first thing I see in this case is this car right here, just kind of sitting on its side. Let's see what this is. This looks to be custom small block. Looks like a new color of that. So we've got a nice one of that. Let's go ahead and start it off at the top now. We've got first the Corvette C6R. We've got the Water Bomber and the Lotus Evaya. Next up here, we've got the 68 Mercury Cougar, Lucid Air in a new white color, and La Fasta looks like a new recolor of that one as well. We've got Turbine Sublime, and we've got the treasure hunt for the case. Amazing, muscle and blown. We can see the little bitty treasure hunt logo just right there, but there we do have the treasure hunt. That looks fantastic. I really like this as a fantasy casting, especially in this like matte kind of satin black paint job with the blacked out wheels and the gold rims on there. It looks great. And next we do have MST Suzuka. Looks like a nice new color of that. We've got the 86 Toyota van with the Da Vinci Veloz up top right here. Corvette C6R. We've got another one of the 68 Mercury Cougar and the 2019 Chevy Silverado Trail Boss LT. All right, good case so far. We've got the Range Rover Classic Max Steel and another one of those Chevy Silverado Trail Boss LTs. I really like this Range Rover. I like that color. It looks really good on that. All right, we'll go right here. We've got the Dodge Challenger SRT right there. 
Very, very cool. I believe that's the Hellcat variation of it. We've got the Pagani Zonda R and the 1990 Acura NSX. That Zonda R and NSX, actually all three of these cars we've seen in the previous case, but they're uh, re-brought over to the P case. And hey, I'm not disappointed. They are fantastic cars. I'd like to have extras of those ones. Very cool. Ooh, check that out. Dodge Viper SRT10 ACR with the Hot Wheels race team livery. Then a now series, love that. Uh, we've got Drone Duty. And I think, I can't remember, yeah, we did get this on the last case, Drone Duty. It's a it's a pretty neat new casting. And the Volkswagen Baja Bug, check out that raised Baja Bug. Wow, very nice. All right, what else do we have? Ooh, check the new Supra, 2020 Toyota GR Supra in a new red color, followed by the Nissan Skyline R35 GTR with the Liberty Walks kit on there in white. Wow, two great new recolors. Super happy to get those. Then we do have the five alarm and I uh, believe that's the glow in the dark color for that one as well. And what else do we have? We've got the 95 Mazda RX-7 in a new color. Check that one out. It looks like the Falcon livery on there. It is Falcon. You can see on the front end right there. That looks cool. Another Trail Boss LT and another Acura NSX. We'll put those ones aside. We've got the Audi RS e-tron GT in red. Check that new color out. Very cool. We've got the Velocita, and this is one of our fast cars down the track. The previous one that we opened up in a previous case is our track champion right now. And we've got the Water Bomber. I think we saw that one in our previous case as well. We'll put those aside. And what else do we have right here? The Altered Ego in the Hot Wheels Racing livery, another one of the Lucid Airs, and check this out. The Aston Martin Vantage GTE. Wow, that looks so good. I love that. Look at that big wing on there, the green color, the graphics all in the hood. Very, very nice. I like that new casting. All right, let's go to the bottom of the case right here. And hopefully we find some more good stuff in here. We are have a great case so far. BMW R90 Racer right there, motorbike. We've got the Carbonator and we've got the Twin Mill 3 right there. That's the third generation of the Twin Mill. Nice new casting. Actually, it's not new. We've seen the Twin Mill 3 before, but it's still a very nice one. I like it. And we'll go to the top right here. We've got the five alarm right there. Very nice. The 1990 Acura NSX. And we've got the 94 Audi Avant RS2. Love that one. They do have this one as a super treasure hunt in the previous case. This is just the mainline variation though of it. So very cool that we got that. What else do we have up here? Oh, wow. Look at this Chevelle SS Express. All blacked out, that looks mean. I love that. Oh, it's got the open hood as well. Look at the exposed engine on there. It's hard to see my lighting, but you can see the card right there with the exposed engine. We have the exposed engine on there. We'll open this one up definitely in a future video. And we've got the another one of the Lotus Avias and the TV series Batmobile as well. And another TV series Batmobile back to back. That's interesting. We don't see that very often. We've got the Track Ripper. And what does that say? Spoiler alert on there. Okay, so it's part of the series, the spoiler alert series. That's an interesting livery on there. And then check it out the new color of the Automobilia Pinifarina Batista in this great new blue color. That looks excellent. I like that. We'll put that aside and we'll go to the top right here. We've got another one of the Nissan GTRs, the Big Air Bel Air. That looks to be a nice new color of that one. It's like a pinkish hue to it. And then we've got the Lolux here, and that looks to be a new color of the Lolux. Check that out. Very nice. I like that color. It's a cool looking bluish color on there. We'll go to the top. We've got La Troca, La Troca in a new color as well. We've got the Volvo 240 Drift Wagon. We saw that in the previous case. And we've got the Mod Rod as well. And our next cars that we have right here, we've got a Drone Duty again. Another one of the La Trocas. And we've got the Shelby Cobra 427 SC in yellow. I love the yellow look to that one. That one looks so good with the Hot Wheels racing livery on the side of it. Wow, very, very nice. Super impressed with that one. We'll grab 
some more here. We've got another one of these Shelby Cobra 427 SCs, another Twin Mill 3, and we've got the 95 Jeep Cherokee in red. I love the off-road look to that one. Very nice looking car. Cool, cool. All right, we'll go down to our next ones here. Another one of the Aston Martin Vantage GTEs, and we've got the Bone Shaker. This looks to be just the uh, the regular one, not a Treasure Hunter or Super or anything like that. We've got the 94 Audi Avant RS2 as well, and we're getting down to the bottom here. We've got the TV series Batmobile. We've got the 32 Ford, and this looks to be just the main line. It doesn't look like the Super Treasure Hunt at all, but uh, very nice for a main line. It's got the Golf livery on there, so I think it looks very, very good. What do you guys think of that one right there? We've got another one of the Volvo 240 Drift Wagons right there, cool, cool. And getting down to the bottom here, Electrac and the Lolux and Velocitas. So three neat fantasy castings right there. There we go. Put those ones aside in our bottom three cars. The last three cars of the Hot Wheels P case. We've got the 2015 Dodge Challenger SRT. We've got the Big Air Bel Air and the Electrac. Let me know guys in the comment section down below which was your favorite car today. We're unboxing the 2022 Hot Wheels Q case. I get all of my cases from Grana Toys. If you wanna get your own Hot Wheels cases sent to you every time a new one comes out, check out granatoys.com. Links in the description box below. The regular treasure hunt for this case is the 71 Mustang Funny Car, and the super treasure hunt for this case is the 81 Camaro. Hopefully we find one of these in this case. All right, let's go ahead and unbox it. And starting up at the top right here, we'll pull out our first few and we've got the La Troca first. And look at that, we've got our treasure hunt right there. This is the 71 Mustang Funny Car Treasure Hunt. And we'll look closely, we can see there is the Treasure Hunt logo just right there on the side fender. So pretty cool that we got the Treasure Hunt for the case. Really, really cool looking style. I like all the colored graphics and stuff on there. And I believe this one will open up. We'll have to see once we actually open the car up and see if it opens, but that's really, really cool that we got that one. And we've got the La Fasta right here as well. And moving on, we'll go to right up top right here. We've got the Dodge SRT10 ACR in blue, bone shaker, and head gasket. I like the color of the helmet on that. That's actually really cool. Hot Wheels art car. So we got all the art pieces on the top, all the like pictures and graphics and stuff. That looks really good. So put those aside. We'll go on to our next ones. Ooh, check that out. 1970 Ford Escort RS 1600 in blue. That's a really cool looking livery on there. We got the 86 Toyota van and MST Suzuka. And what else do we have? We've got Turbine Sublime, and it looks like a new color variation, custom small block, and the Batmobile, and check out the finish of the paint on that. It's like a matte green. That is crazy looking. Very stealth. I really like this car because I like the exposed engine on the back. You can see it's got like that titanium exposed engine that kind of comes out, so pretty cool. Can't wait to open that one up. Next up top, we've got another 86 Toyota van. We've got the Automobilia Pininfarina Batista. We saw this one in the previous case, really like that new recolor of it. Then we've got the 65 Mustang 2 Plus 2 Fastback. And we've got next up the Audi RS e-tron GT in red. And another red car, we've got the 2020 Toyota GR Supra. Look at those, looking fresh in that glossy red color. Then we've got the 2006 Pontiac GTO. Looks like a new color variation of that one. Nice colored wheels as well, pretty neat. And we'll go on. We've got the Dodge Viper SRT10 ACR in blue, another one of those. Ooh, look at this yellow Camaro, 69 Copo Camaro in yellow. That looks so cool. Really like that, I can't wait to open that one up. Then we've got the Ford Shelby GT350R. And I believe that one is a new color variation before. I can't remember if we got a blue one of that one before. We might've got like a darker, like a more navy-ish type blue. This is more of a metallic blue on here. We got the blacked out roof on top as well. So that one's pretty neat. I can't wait to open that one up as well. Then we've got 
the drone duty right there. We've got the McLaren Elva in its first recolor. Initial release in black. Now we've got a nice new recolor of that one. Then we've got the Volkswagen Baja Bug. We saw that one, I believe, in the previous case as well, but excited to still get another one of those ones. Then we've got Honda Civic Custom. Check that one out, another red car as well. And then we've got like the white pieces all customized out. Then we've got the uh, Nissan GTR, the Liberty Walk Edition Nissan GTR. There's that white recolor. We saw that one in our previous case as well. Then we got the 95 Jeep Cherokee, another red car. Like glossy red seems to be the theme for a lot of the cars in this case. And some of them came for the previous case as well. We've got uh, another one of those Batmobiles. There we go. We've got the 95 Mazda RX-7 with the Falcon livery on there, looking fresh. And there's another one of those 2020 Toyota GR Supras in the gloss red. All right, go down to our bottom row here. We've got La Fasta. We've got the Sand Burner. There's another red car right there. Check that out, Sand Burner. That looks to be a new recolor as well. MST Suzuka again. And then our bottom row right here, the Audi RS e-tron GT and the mock mock it go mock it go. That's a really cool looking car. You can see the uh, it's kind of it looks like an X racers type of car, but it's labeled under the Hot Wheels Speed Team series, but it looks like an X racer. We've got the carbonator, which has the actual little piece in the back, which you can use to open up a, a bottle. So carbonator. So if you need a bottle opener, there you go. Just grab a carbonator and you are good to go. All right. Bottom case right here. We'll go up to our top and grab those. We've got the Track Ripper. There's another red car, Track Ripper. I think we got this recolor in the previous case as well. And we got the Chevelle SS Express in gloss black. I really like this one. We saw this in our previous case, so good. And what do you know, let's add another red car to the case. We've got the Dodge Challenger Drift Car in red. 426 Drift Car, looking good. I like that, all right. Put that down, grab our top right here. We've got the Automobili Pinaferina Batista again. Another one of those. Ooh, Aston Martin V12 Speedster in matte black. Wow, did not expect that. That is so cool looking. And then look at this. We've got the Matt and Debbie Hayes 1988 Pro Street Thunderbird. There's gotta be a story behind this on why there's like the specific name of the person's vehicle that they made. So I don't know the exact story, but that looks really good. They've gone done a great job. I don't know if this is a new cast. I would assume this is, has to be a new casting. I could be wrong though. We don't have any new for 2022 written on there or anything like that, but what a crazy color and crazy looking car. Guys, comment down below the story on this car. If you know the story on this Thunderbird, there's gotta be a story to that one. All right, we'll go on to our top right here. We've got the Track Ripper in red. We've got the Batmobile again. And check this out. Is this a new color of the 71 Lamborghini Mira SV? Wow, I like that. This is a good case so far. Really, really good. Lots of good cars in this case. And we'll go on to our top row right there. Carbonator again, so another one of those. Then we've got the Renin Rig. And I can't remember if this is a new casting or not. I don't, I think I have seen this one before but there it is in yellow. We've got two different wheel tire combinations on there. We've got the Honda Super Cab. Check that one out, bent card on this, unfortunately, it wasn't packed properly, but we do have a uh, nice color to that one. Kind of an interesting, I'm not really a big fan of like these weird motorbikes and stuff that they have in cases. So I like sport bikes, so like Ducatis and stuff are cool, but any of those weird bikes, not really my thing. All right, we're going on to the 72 Ford Gran Torino Sport in orange. We've got the Mod Rod, and of course we got another red car. We got the 1940 Ford pickup truck right there. There we go, Ford pickup in red, of course, red. And we'll go on. We've got the uh, Liberty Walk Nissan GTR, and check this one out, Lotus Emura in blue. Wow, I love that blue. That blue looks so good. Very, very nice. Super excited to get that one. Check that one out. I can't wait to open this one up. This one looks very similar to the Porsche 911 GT3 blue that we got in uh, probably like three or four cases ago. But wow, that looks really good. We've got the HW Rapid Response car as well, the ambulance. All right, I'll put that aside. We've got 
the La Troca, La Troca, very nice. 84 Audi Sport Quattro in there. There we go, that's another one in that like similar blue. Actually, let's grab our Lotus. Very, very similar blues. Maybe the, the Audi looks maybe a bit lighter of a blue. I love this Audi with the white wheels though. I think it looks fantastic. Very, very cool. We've got the Courtney Cab Taxi Edition right there. I'll put that aside. What else do we have? We got the Volkswagen Baja Bug. We've got Drone Duty and the 95 Jeep Cherokee. Two red cars, of course. <laughs> we'll go down here. And we've got the Aston Martin Vantage GTE. We did see this one in our previous case, so that's pretty cool. We got the uh, Matt and Debbie Hayes Pro Street Thunderbird again, so another one of those. And woo, look at this, another matte black finish. We had the Aston Martin. This time we've got the Porsche 911 GT3 in a matte black. That looks so good. Look at the gray wheels to go as well. Very, very cool. And then we'll go on here. We've got the 81. Wait a second. What? Are you guys seeing this? What? Oh my. We have two super treasure hunts. The, what? This has to be the Q, This has to be a mistake. I don't know what to say. This is what? We have two super treasure hunts in a case. This, I've never seen this before. This is insane. Oh my gosh. What? Two. Uh, uh, am I right? Like these are super treasure hunts. I'm literally shaking here, guys. This is crazy. What? Two super treasure hunts in a case, 81 Camaros, and they're both packed together as well. That's so weird. What? Oh my, I, I, I'm, I'm, in sh I'm speechless. I can't, I don't know what to say. What? 81 Camaro double super treasure hunt in 2022 Hot Wheels Q case. That is crazy. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I, I wow. Y you guys are seeing this, this is, I'm doing this, I'm filming this video, and wow. That, that, I'm, I, I don't know what to say, I'm sorry guys, I'm literally lost for words, that's insane. Okay, let's 32 Ford, I'm, I'm shaking guys, I, I've never experienced doubles, I haven't had a super treasure hunt in a case for so long. Crazy, brick and speed, there's another one of the Lotuses, cruise bruiser, yeah, I'm, I'm, I feel like I'm cruising through this case now because I'm just so excited here. We've got the Courtney Cab 2, 95 Mazda RX-7, and Electrac from X Racers. Can, uh, can you believe this, guys? Two super treasure hunts in one case. Absolutely crazy, I've never seen this before. I'm actually gonna go on YouTube right now and see if anyone ever found two super treasure hunts in a single Hot Wheels case. I, I, wow, insane, insane. I'm actually gonna message Granite Toys and tell them like, have you guys ever seen this before? This is crazy, there we go. 81 Camaro, double super treasure hunt find. I've never seen this before, absolutely crazy guys. All right, we'll put those aside. If you guys enjoyed this video, what a, that, that's gotta be the best case I've ever unboxed with the amount of cars that we had in here. 2022 Hot Wheels Q case. By far the best case I've ever unboxed. Before even those super treasure hunts, this case was amazing. Guys, hit that thumbs up and I'll catch you guys on our next one. Bye-bye.